A small comic I drew for my son's birthday. Oi, what do you have there? A sword. Luffy, no! Aizuku! Oh, it is not a oh god. That is pretty much how that went down. Drew this for his son's birthday though. Peak parenting. Oh Luffy, stop eating all that fast food. I'm cooking a large meal for everyone. But this is ready now. Who are we kidding? His stomach is a bottomless pit. Shut up and bring me more sake, cook. Oh god. And they're back to eating the food, alright? Average crew dynamics, honestly. One piece tough luck. Okay, what's this? We've got Boa flirting with Luffy. Is that Nami and is that Luffy's kid? Okay, they're reminiscing over the food. Luffy wrapping around her body. It should have been me. And Nami's asking Zoro for a sword. All right. Well, I'm guessing this is two-piece because where the hell did Luffy get a kid? I don't even know if Luffy knows how to make one of those, to be honest. Is this the same universe? Giant pistol? What the hell? Luffy turns small in front of his kid and he grabbed him like a teddy bear. Is this Luffy meeting Spider-Man? What is this? Hey, you're really awesome. I want you to join my crew. Whoops. Oh, God. All right. And now Peter's trying to kill Luffy. That didn't work out in his favor. Before quarantine after quarantine this meme is so accurate had me looking like Usopp during the time skip it was bad Robin I have a question what does coochie mean oh god not the Robin annoyed face <laughs> what is this she's like I knew this day would come but not today chopper character development uh, Vivi and Wapples my it should have been me what is this God damn it! I already didn't like Wapple, but now I'm hoping they kill his ass in the live action. Why are they looking so menacingly? Wrong answers only. Come on, man. They're just standing there. Menacingly. Oh, God. Another day in the Straw Hat fleet. Oh, God. Ah, uh, no, that's amazing. Poor Cavendish. Bro's just sitting there for no reason. It's just 100% accurate, though. This might even be canon. Especially the way that Bartos drawing Luffy. Nah, this is only some shit he or Boa Hancock could cook up. Peak talent. Oh, my God. Does this man have buggy on his fridge? Oh, this is peak. This is dedication right here. Why is this a random hand? What? Who's stuck in your fridge? Nefertari D. Buggy. Oh no. What is this gonna be? A pirate named Crocodile has taken over our country. Can you help me for free? Uncle Buggy? But what if he really is the best manager? Uncle! Are you not ashamed to wear our national clothes if you give our homeland to our enemy? <laughs> not the post. Your father always said that I was not suitable for the Nefertari family. It's because I never wanted to be a prince. You can't tell a person that he is not the right one and they expect him to be the right one. It's not because I want revenge. It's because I trust your father. I think he's right. Facts, facts. Buggy is not the right one to lead the country. He's supposed to be Pirate King instead. Can't take the man from his true purpose. Obviously. Guys, I think we may have messed up. How old is Carrot One Piece? 15 years old. N nigga, who's we? You messed up. Brody's trying to take down the subreddit with him. I'm done. Bro, why is he there? Oh god, why is Zoro in the background? Zoro's anywhere! No matter what meme you're looking at, there's like a 9 out of 10 chance Zoro's gonna be in the background. Somewhere, if you look hard enough. Who's the person who could beat Buggy D Goat Clown? Oda. That's it, really. Buggy D Clown and Monkey D Luffy. I finally drew the goats. Oh, this is sick. Oh, this is dope. The Buggy one is specifically. This is so far. I like the way that you did the shading. Especially the eyes. He's had a creepy clown look. I like that. I like that a lot. Rents do. Alright, okay. I've never beaten the rents do allegations. A motherfucker learns how to daily upload, and I get hit with rents do every 10 comments. What's going on? I drew Pushy's iconic catchphrase. Oh, nah, bro did not redraw the fucking me. <laughs> I'm done. Bro put the detail on the Dewey. One Piece live action if they had a tight budget. Uh, oh, okay. Alright. But he's on crack? I know. Alright. What is going on here? What am I watching? Now, be honest, as a community, smash your past. Why is this one of the top upvoted things in the past 24 hours? What? I, my subreddit, I swear. It started off with funny One Piece memes. Now it's just horny fuckers. Y'all need to repent. The final saga begins. It all depends on who finds the One Piece. Notice how there's only one thing in this panel that didn't have to be changed the goat buggy d clown because that's who's really gonna find the one piece what are we saying now it's already set in stone we know the results buggy d clown versus down d stairs now this is sick what the fuck is bro carrying stairs on a stick what is that why does this only have one upvote oh no okay it's got seven but still clearly people aren't appreciating peak fiction he's such a legend for this a french youtuber climb mount everest with a straw hat oh what bro even did the pose nah that is so hard explaining one piece to a newcomer with no context there's a talking giraffe falling through the ceiling yeah even in context that one's a little wild new to one piece our one piece fans really like this um excuse me but there's only one peak oh god only one talking to boruto fans really and you have to be on twitter but yes to answer your question yes they're selling these for a combo price? Oh, hell no. <laughs> they knew what they were doing. Freaky spinoff. Oh, why do we have pre-glow up Kobe? Is this the egghead y'all want to watch? I don't know what I should answer. Yes, it's Zoro. Okay, wait, wait, what does it mean? And why is it obvious that it's Zoro? Is your character a well-known racist? Okay, <laughs> all right. <laughs> There's no way the Akinator asked that. Bastard thinks he's about to get away with this, huh? Let's see him get this info out of me. Characters. Have hair? Yes. A boy? Yes. 
from a Japanese anime that, that he's getting closer. Does your character have dark hair? No. White hair? No. Yellow hair? Okay, buddy's just uh, going through all the pro tags. No. Is your character friends with a rabbit? No. Unless he counts snow bunnies. Does Alvita count? Does your character have legs? Yes. Human? Yes. I mean, technically he's a god, but that's neither here nor there. Okay, I clicked was your character from One Piece, and now it is your character a clown. These son of a bitches. Does your character have a red nose? I don't know. Some say it's magenta. Is your character a sea captain? Ah, this son of a bitch buggy D clown. He even put the D. Son of a bitch. He won't get me twice. Is your character still alive? Yes. Does your character have any kids? Nope. Is your character short? Yes. In a relationship? I think so. Not 100% on that one. Live in Arkansas? No. A ninja? No. Enter competitions? No. Foxy? Oh, hell no. This isn't Gaimon. I beat this nigga! No. Continue? Oh, this bastard thinks I'm gonna give him a second chance. Enter competitions? No. Use a devil fruit? No. Is your character usually in a bot? I hate this nigga. What? He went through every character in the book! It's cheating. I still beat him the first time. Does your character live in a box? Maybe. Perhaps. Friends with a pirate? Perhaps. Damn it! We almost had him too. Bounty hunters' importance in One Piece? Hey man, technically, Blackbeard's crew could be bounty hunters. Since, you know, you could hunt the bounties of marines now. So, hey, we're all bounty hunters if we want to get paid. Perfect. Generic Nami cosplay starter pack? Oh god! Nah. That's like divine intervention right there. The Reddit gods were like, let me show you something funny. The reason Frothawk decided to work under Buggy D Goat. This is an accurate image right here. I don't know if you know, but this is actually an image that was removed from the anime. This is a censored image. Just like four kids, actually. Toei, they just, they, they couldn't leave this in because they thought it was just too early to reveal Buggy's might on screen. So, you know, they had to let the censorship cook. It was honestly not even their fault. I would have made them do it. It's facts, by the way. I would have said that shit. No cap. The math doesn't lie. There's nothing we could do about it. At the beginning, the Nami cosplays were spaced apart 24 weeks, then 12, then 6, then every two weeks. The last one in r slash one piece was a week ago. In four days, we could be seeing a Nami cosplay every eight hours until they're coming every four minutes. We will all be turning into Nami cosplayers within seven days. Oh, God. Oh, well. The statistics don't seem to lie. Who the fuck made this image? Oh god. Oh no. Why? Who drew this slander of my goat? This is some bullshit. Von Ogre could never. That's a very big hole. Okay. Damn, how do I lift this guy up? There's a hole. Put your arm through there. Oh no. All right. Well, that's just disrespectful. Meanwhile, in an alternate timeline. Yeah, this is something I didn't need to see. Not at all. What am I looking at? Why? And why does Robin Loki pull that outfit off more than Zoro does still? Ain't that some shit? Why do people keep on swapping Robin's egghead clothes with Zoro when they were clearly meant for Frankie? Oh god. What? No bullshit. It would actually fit his character. He's not even lying. Oh fuck. Did Nami sit here? Sniff. Oh god. Oh no. What did I just see? That is so cursed. Relatable. Why is Eustace so hated by the fandom? Well, being a Eustace kid fan feels like- Oh god! <laughs> <laughs> Fuck that nigga. Useless D-mid. Smoking on his pack right now, in fact. Hold on. It's that kid pack. I know Kuhn. Oh no. Why? What is this? And why does it look like it's meant to be like this? <laughs> Finding Eustace. Oh no. What are the chances? Right after we were talking about kid slander. Poetic. I'm glad you showed up. I was just in need of an arm. My arm. You bastard. What are you, a cannibal? Oh, uh, poor kid. Oh fuck. Oh fuck. Oh fuck. Let's jump his ass. Oh god. Nah, I look east. Hey man, nothing wrong with looking east. It's where all the best sunsets take place. Weezeru is the greatest speedster. Okay, don't even lie to yourself. My goat Wally West can make it to the fucking finish line eight different times, take a shit, wipe his ass, put it on Kizaru's fucking forehead, then make it to the finish line one more time, blitz him again, run back and forth, go visit Kizaru's mother, f her a couple times, then make it to the finish line. And that nigga would still only be halfway there. Let's not sleep on the gold, alright? Only Buggy D Clown can handle such speeds. That's my One Piece channel, so it doesn't get talked about enough, but Wally West on top. Don't play with the gold. But every yellow smoking, I want some. It must be hella expensive to get this high. Okay, must have been that kid pack. I'm pretty sure flashes broke the speed of light long ago. Speed of light? The speed of light is literally nothing to any flash. Except for maybe fucking Jay Garrick. Wally West literally moves faster than instant teleportation, gang. Nigga is faster than the speed force that gave him his speed. The definition of broken. Are you going to sleep? Yes, I am. Shut up. How do Logia users turn their clothes into an element? Ah, uh, hey man, that's called One Piece science. We'll never know.